Welcome to the Reed College Ski Cabin. Come on in. My name is Eric. I'm the current manager who lives here and takes care of the place. A lot has changed uh, in the summer of 2010 from May to October. Uh, we closed this place down. Uh, as you pan around, you might notice that this living room looks about the same. This is kind of the, the heart and soul of the cabin. The goal is to replicate the knotty pine walls and kind of the whole vibe of this room into every other room on this level. Addition called a sunroom. This is where the old sauna was. It uh, tore down the old sauna deck and put in a full addition, which is now this sunroom and uh, two beds above it and a whole firewood storage room beneath it. So they went ahead and they put the kitchen on the sunny side of the house, which really complemented this deck. This table was made by an alumni college from wood that came from another alumni's tree farm. Let me show you upstairs. Now all of the sleeping is upstairs. We have a total of 14 beds, which is our capacity before the renovation. And you might notice this is a brand new dormer that was put in. Kind of goes over the deck a little bit. In the original house we had one shower. Now we've got four. Down to the entertainment part of the house. When you come to the ski cabin, we do have a couple things you can use. We have a snowshoe collection. There's about nine pairs. Um, so definitely bring your gaiters and your waterproof boots if you plan on using those in the snow. And you might notice kind of a hodgepodge of things. People donated a snowboard, a bunch of donated sleds. Uh, we do kind of keep sleds up here and we do appreciate it if you bring anything you'd like to donate to the ski cabin as far as extra recreational tools and, and such. During the winter time, we do have a waxing table set up so you can sharpen and you can wax your skis. Really handy. Went ahead and got a ping pong table. And of course we have our foosball and our darts. And what's a ski cabin without a sauna? So now we've got a sauna, a bathroom, and a shower down here on this level. We used to have an area where you could leave the sauna and get into the snow. Now you can leave the sauna this way and we're under the deck. Uh, the snow will overwhelm this area and you will have a uh, nice snow pile. 